Here with much more on what's driving the market action today is Yahoo Finance's Ines Ferre. Ines. And Karina, you mentioned consumer discretionary and energy stocks that are leading the gains today. If we just take a look at our Wi-Fi interactive board, you can see the 11 sectors of the S&P 500. And if you pull up a month to date chart, you can see that consumer discretionary was actually underperforming and energy underperforming compared to the rest of the uh, sectors. But today, these are the leaders. Let's look at where we're at with the NASDAQ 100. The big outperformer today being Tesla up more than 6% earlier, Tesla up 7%, going up above $1,000 per share. And then looking at the Dow, we are watching on the Dow, one of the better performers being Caterpillar, up uh, almost 2%. This is after uh, Bernstein put out an outperform rating on Caterpillar, upgrading the stock. Then just looking at the RX space, I've been watching Pfizer shares uh, up almost 2%, Pfizer near session highs. Uh, after the company's antiviral pool was approved for emergency use authorization by the FDA. It's first actually at-home COVID drug and if we're looking also at Moderna, the Moderna shares have been at session lows after that Pfizer news. And lastly, I just want to point out where we're at with travel today because we are seeing more gains for travel. If I just pull up a two-day chart, you can see quite a bit of grain over the last two days uh, for the travel stocks. Karina, Jared. Yeah, we thank you for that. Yahoo Finance is in S for A.